All right, guys, what is up? In this video, we'll be talking about Bitcoin. Ticker symbol BTC. Bitcoin is crashing fast, okay? I did give you guys some last defense levels to be watching out for, okay? This is just a, a buying level. Buying level acted as resistance. That's one first sign of bearishness. And then I gave you guys a last defense level. I said if this level breaks and it does not retest the next day, that is very bearish. Okay, so I'll be giving you guys all new levels I'll be looking out for as well. Going over the old levels, make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe if you are new. I'm trying to get over a thousand subscribers by February 1st. Let's get to it. So the level did break. Okay, first buying level act as resistance. That's already a bear sign, so we'll take that off. We had a last defense level right around 42,000. That broke on the 20th. Broke on the 20th. The 21st did not return to it. Okay, I do not count this wick. 21st and not return to it and you can see we're going bearish now okay that was a sign now for a support level let's take this off so i'll be giving you guys a big support level big support level big support level if that support level breaks we could be in for a long term downtrend okay that's something that i really want you guys to be paying attention to especially if you're in bitcoin now I did sell some Bitcoin, okay? I sold some Bitcoin in the 40s, the 40,000s. Like I said, it looked very weak. Sold some Bitcoin, but I did actually buy some Ethereum. So I'll probably uh, make a video on Ethereum, but I did sell Bitcoin. I'm expecting a bigger pullback in Bitcoin, okay? So to put this level on here, let me go to the, five, the four hour chart. So the support level that I see right now is right at $31,000, okay? 31,000, I think it's a big support level, big last defense level. If that breaks, we are for sure seeing Bitcoin below 30,000 to the 20s, okay? A lot of people said once Bitcoin fell from those highs back down to the 50s and 40s, they would buy. No one is buying this right now. A lot of people are selling. Maybe some people are buying, but right now, just every market is very heavy right now. Like I said, I did sell some Bitcoin because um, I'm looking to buy it at lower prices. I am looking to buy it in the 20s, so you kind of know where my head is. That's why I sold uh, in the 40s, because if I didn't sell, I would have been down, I would have been down over 22%, and even more, because I think it's gonna go in the 20s, okay? So you just have to always move with the market conditions, take your emotions out of your trades. You're here to make money. You're not here uh, to be right or hold strong or anything. You're here to make money. Okay, always remember that. So this is a big level that I'm looking out for right there, around 32,000. Now, for me to buy again, like for me to um, start putting money in here to try to buy, it would need to go like above, it would need to go above like 37,000. Where is that at? Right here. For me to even want to uh, start buying Bitcoin again. Okay, it would need to go above that 37,000 mark. So these right now are the main two levels that I'm kind of watching out for uh, to see what I really want to do. Comes back up here, I'll watch it to see if I want to start buying again because I think the trend is going to go higher. Or if this breaks, I'm watching it to go on those 20,000s and I'll for sure be buying them. Okay, so just make sure you watch out for these levels. Thank you guys for watching the video. In the comment section below, let me know uh what uh cryptos you guys are watching and i'll make some videos on those don't forget to get your webull account first link in the description you get a couple free socks when you deposit a hundred dollars always remember no trick updation about so anything this is for educational purposes only so do not trade anything you see right here in the video and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye